the reason I'm going to vote is that every single election, we are creating our country with every single ballot that we cast. The idea of America is an emerging idea, and we're in a constant experiment. And every single time we vote, we get to actively co-create the country that we want to be in. I'm reminded over and over again that I have to be the change that I want to be, and I have to be the one to help create that and enact that in my family, in my community, and in my country. My dad voted for Trump in 2016. He came here with $250 in his pocket and has grown into a very successful business person and has provided a lot for my family and for my family in India. And he does it through constant, rigorous work. Yesterday I had a conversation with my dad and he's like, you know, I think Trump is a very dishonest person and I'm not gonna vote for him. So here's my dad like going through this process of figuring out what's right for him, his values, the legacy he wants to, you know, create and leave versus what the challenges that he's gone through his whole life to become where he is today. I don't think that there's anything more powerful than voting. This is proof that we do have a voice. And this is our final push. You're not just voting for yourself. You're voting for the people that need the support. You're helping to give a voice to people. So every single time I think about my dad and where he's come from and what he's built for us here, it's my responsibility to vote. I'm gonna wake up on November 4th and say to myself, I did every single thing I could do to have a different outcome in the election. People are over the outrage and we need to really focus on what we're for, not what we're against. Make a plan, use your power, vote.